The Legend of the Shepherds In a bygone age of myths, when darkness threatened to enshroud the world, it was they who reclaimed light from nothingness. Over and over, as the world plunged into chaos, the legend would come to people's lips, and they would pray for salvation. And lo, each time a shepherd would appear to vanquish the darkness once more. But with peace returned, it was never long before the shepherds would vanish. As for where they had gone, no one can truly say. And, as with all things, eventually they faded into legend. Once again, the world faced the threat of the darkness. people began to speak of the shepherds once more. But alas, no shepherd came forth to guide his people to peace. I knew it! A hero brandishing the sacred blade! This mural is a depiction of the shepherd! <laughs> About time I found it! Nothing on my end, Soray. Miklio! Looks like he beat me this time. This proves the Shepherds have been around since even before the era of Asgard. I knew it! Let's not jump to conclusions just yet. We still don't have definitive proof that this ruin itself is pre-Asgard. It could be an imitation. Seriously? You really think they'd make a fake ruin of this scale? Get real.
This doesn't bode well. Wait, isn't that... I think our ruin adventure is over for today. Too close. Could I get a little help, please? Saray. That didn't go quite how I planned it, but not too shabby, am I right? Guess this makes us even. Unbelievable. Who knew there'd be ruins underground? Oh, good thing we fell down here. Right. Hey, let's try and find a way out of here. Hmm? Oh, yeah. Whoa! Oh man, what a drop! It's been nothing but heights all day. But I had an awesome bar relief to distract me. Yeah, I bet you did. Hmm? It looks like someone's lying there. Hey, Miklio? Hmm? It's... it's a human. It can't be. Stop. We shouldn't involve ourselves with their kind. She's still alive. We can't just leave her there. Fine. I'll give what help I can. Let's take a look around the area first. Okay. Yeah, my sword's all sticky. Cobwebs everywhere. I bet no one has set foot in here for some time. What's wrong? Shh. seen one in person before. What could a monster like a Hellion be doing in a place like this? It's getting away! Wait, don't you remember what Gramps told us? Huh? Hellions? Yep, Hellions. Horrible monsters that are created by the Malevolence. They can only be defeated by the power of purification. 
which not but a chosen few can use. So if you ever cross paths with a Hellion, just run as fast as you can. Remember, you two, common folks like us don't stand a chance against those fiends. Cut it! We can't beat a Hellion without the power of purification. Then we should just be glad we escaped it. And anyway, we have bigger problems. Hmm? We have to hurry and save that girl. Before something worse finds her. Is that a monolith? Sense the ancient tongue. We're near one. Shall we again? Yeah! Be gone! Strike! It's over! I'll be taking this. If you get too hung up on fiddling with it, we'll never get out of here. I'll give it back once we return safely. Uh, <laughs> if you say so. So close, but it's still so far. 
Think we could jump? Only one way to find out. Okay, maybe not. Hey, watch out! Don't scare me like that. Sorry about that. Well, we definitely can't make it from here. There should be a connecting point somewhere. What? Huh. You don't suppose... Huh? There. Take a look. Hmm? Go on. Look closer. Come on, we don't have time for this. Let's cut the fun and games, all right? Oh, then let me explain. As you see... Ugh, forget it. Let's just go back down there. <laughs> you never could handle losing. That human probably got caught up in all the lightning just like we did. More like the other way around. We have her to thank for all that crash boom bang. That lightning. That was Gramps, wasn't it? Yeah. It's a warning to invaders. Not one more step. <sighs> Sorry, Gramps. I can't just leave someone who needs help. Huh. This is turning into an eventful day for once. That was a cool monolith. We've had quite a bounty of discoveries today. If I'm not mistaken, that stone is a lot newer than the surrounding ruins. Yeah, it's from a completely different age. It read like advice of some sort. Most likely it's a guidepost left by previous visitors to aid fellow travelers. So we're not the only ones who go around investigating ruins. Humans have terms for them. Things like adventurer or explorer. Explorers. I see. So that's the deal. Who would have thought that you could walk in midair here? Or that an invisible bridge would be here. Think it could support a person? Well, well. Aren't you sharp today? <laughs> For a change. Psh. Seems safe enough. Yeah. Maybe we should rethink this. Hey. Uh, are you all right? Uh, huh. <sighs> I was. I was in a forest, and then... Looking for this? <laughs> yep, she's human, all right. Yeah. Glad you're okay. I'm sorry to have troubled you. And you are? Your name. Uh, oh. Right. My name. I'm Saray. Saray? Yep. Nice to meet you. Well met. Is there anywhere one could rest around here? 
I'll need to make plans to get back to the capital. You're from the city? Well... Um... Hmm. Why don't you come to where I live? Saray, are you nuts? Are you sure that wouldn't be a problem? You barely know me. I can't just abandon someone in need. That's all. Haven't you noticed that she won't even volunteer her name? It's only natural to be cautious. Aren't you going to ask my name? Are you sure? Everyone has their reasons, but you don't look like a bad person to me. I cannot possibly thank you enough, Saray. <sighs> Gramps is gonna let us have it when we get back. I know. Yes? Nah, don't worry about it. Anyway, that's the way out. Let's get moving. I don't want to have to remind you, but keep your eyes on the girl. Okay. But too bad we didn't meet in better circumstances. <sighs> you really don't have a skeptical bone in your body. We made it back in one piece. Wow, it's beautiful. Like a shrine out of myth, I half expect to see Seraphim wandering around. You really do call them Seraphim. Is that funny to you? Nope. Things which cannot be seen or explained, such as gods, spirits, or supernatural phenomena, are revered by the people as Seraphim. Right? A quote from the Celestial Record? Bingo! You've read it too? Yep. Wait, you as well? I used to read it all the time when I was a kid. It's a little ways from here to my village. Let's get moving. Okay.